Hey everyone, today we have this incredible Infinite Black Metallic 2022 Lincoln Nautilus Reserve in the 201A package. This one has all kinds of upgrades. Let's check it out together. The first big upgrade is the 335 horsepower 2.7 liter twin turbo engine under the hood. That is Lincoln's high performance motor mated to an eight speed transmission with silky smooth shifts, making it amazing on fuel. You then have these beautiful LED fully automatic, including auto high beam headlights. Come down to the front and you have front park sensors. To go with those, you have an around view camera with a camera in the front, cameras under both mirrors and a camera in the back. The vehicle has a forward collision system with pedestrian detection. So if somebody does not uh, let you know in time that they're gonna stop, the vehicle will actually slam on the brakes for you, saving lives and saving you a little money on insurance. You see this nice little sensor here by the front wheel. That is for the self park feature. Yes, this one can actually parallel park itself. It also has the upgraded 21 inch aluminum alloy wheels that look so good. I love the nautical theme of this vehicle and those wheels go really well with it. You see the word Nautilus on the side. That's the only badge you'll see on the vehicle saying that as this is practically debadged. And then you do have these uh, high gloss black mirrors to match the paint with LED signal lights in them. They are a power folding heated mirror with a memory function and a blind spot detection system so that lights up when someone's in your blind spot. To get in or out of this vehicle you can just put your code in here and it'll unlock or you can put your hand inside the door handle and it'll unlock with the heat of your hands. Press this little button with your thumb and the mirrors power fold in, letting you know it's locked. You also have this key fob with unlock, lock, remote start, power lift gate and alarm, or you can download the Link and Way app and do that all for free anywhere you have cell phone connection. Awesome, tinted windows off the back look great. Again, if we put our hands inside of this door handle, we can open this up and then you'll see our interior. You see we've got the seats down right now to show you just maximum cargo space back here. I love the high gloss black finish that's been done. Um, beautiful accent stitching. And if we wanna put these seats up, you'll see we have um, beautiful bridge of wear leather. This leather is from the Highlands of Scotland. They've been doing fine quality leather products for over a hundred years. The rear seats are heated as well. And you do have all weather mats in here. Look up top and you'll see a huge panoramic sunroof with power shade, letting in all kinds of natural light. As we come to the back, we have more rear park sensors, nice dual exhaust, looks nice and sporty. You see the Lincoln off the back here, the backup camera with its own washer so it can spray itself off. And this power lift gate can be opened up from the key or we can just wave our foot like a magic wand and that'll open that up for us. In the back, we have all kinds of cargo space. You can see this has a cargo net, also has a cargo cover, which is removable. You can see we've got the one seat down right there. We can actually put both seats down if we want just by pressing these buttons and then gives you maximum cargo space. This does have an upgraded Revel audio system. There is the subwoofer for that and you can see that beautiful interior from here. Let's go up to the front and check out some of these features. All right, gonna open up the driver's door. On this door here, again, more of that nice high gloss black finishing, another one of those Revel audio speakers. You have memory features, your power locks, power mirrors, power windows. When you get in, the word Lincoln lights up. On the dash, you have real wood trim applique. Um, the wood is all cut from the same piece inside, so you could fit it all together if you took it all apart. Um, we've got controls for our automatic headlights, interior dimmer switches, power lift gate, traction control. You have power tilt and telescopic steering, goes up and down and in and out. On the signal light stock, you can press a button right here to turn on and off your lane departure warning system. And then you have these 10 way adjustable, heated and cooled, beautiful again, bridge of wear leather seats. Let's climb inside. Okay, now that we are inside the vehicle, we're gonna go ahead and hit this push button start right there. All the settings are memory coming back for me. Nice digital display in here, including a digital speedometer and a bunch of other readouts. And you can go through the different menus if you'd like. On your steering wheel, we have controls for the volume and stereo. Then we have our cruise control, which is adaptive. It'll slow you down with the vehicle in front of you. It does have the lane centering system, which is Lincoln's semi-autonomous driving system. It'll actually steer the steering wheel for you using the lines on the road and even go around corners. On this side, more controls for that display up top phone controls, music, settings, update your navigation, 
And then this leather wrapped steering wheel is heated, feels like a warm cup of coffee first thing in the morning. You have this huge display, which is beautiful and new for 2022. Uh, I love all the constellation and graphics that are in here. Um, for instance, if we press this, you'll see the little constellation kind of come up. This does have a navigation system, hard based, and it has the new Sync 4, which means that this is a connected navigation. You also have over the air updates and wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. What does that mean? That means when we connect our smartphone to this wirelessly, this can become our smartphone, uh, our apps from our phone, everything comes up here so you can listen to your podcasts, your audiobooks. You can even use the maps from your phone if you don't want to use this GPS. We go into the settings menu. One of my favorite things here, if we come over ambient lighting, what does that do? Gives us seven different interior colors, one for every day of the week if we'd like. On your climate control screen here, nicely animated is your heated steering wheel button. So nice for that. The vehicle also has a Wi-Fi hotspot ability to be able to connect up to 10 devices. Come down below, press this, and this is our self-park. We can either navigate to a parking lot or we can have the vehicle park for us, which we can have it pull us out of a parking spot, parallel park or perpendicular park, all awesome features. Hit this button, camera. We'll bring up our camera system. We can see all around the vehicle or in front of us. Press it again and we see some different views. Then we have a features button here, which brings up auto start stop or auto hold. Auto hold lets you take your foot off the brake while you're at a satellite or a stop sign. The vehicle won't go anywhere until you touch the gas. Then we have our piano key style shifters, including park, reverse, neutral, drive, and sport mode. When you're in sport mode, it's sometimes fun to shift using these paddle shifters in the back of the steering wheel. Volume controls for our stereo. All our climate controls here, including a menu button. Press this and the big screen populates with a climate control. Our heated and air conditioned seats. Open this up. You have USB and USB-C connection as well as a wireless charge pad. Cup holders here, which lights at the bottom. Again, seven different colors. Nice armrest. Open this up. You have an upper and a lower section with a 12 volt power supply. Come up top and you have an electrochromatic auto dimming mirror. We've got some map lights, power sunroof controls and power shade controls. Speaking of shade, you put your sunglasses in there and then we have garage door openers to finish that off. This is this beautiful 2022 Lincoln Nautilus. Thanks a lot for watching this video. Do me a huge favor, click subscribe to this channel. If you wanna see more videos like this, go ahead and hit that bell icon. You'll be notified every time I make a video. And as always, if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Thanks everyone.